So yeah, my name's Kasim, I'm 21, and I've been locked in in the trenches for the past two months in my bedroom, building my online businesses. And inshallah, by the end of the year, I plan to make over a million dollars, of course, through my online businesses. So I thought, let me just show you guys what my day looks like, what my daily routine is, how I'm doing this in this kind of phase of just spending all day, every single day working. Because a lot of guys like to glorify what it looks like being an entrepreneur, but this is the truth. What I'm going to show you guys today is the raw truth of how it actually looks if you truly want to transform your life and go from zero to a million dollars in around six, seven months. So let's do it. So let me just show you guys what we're working with. Let me show you guys the, the setup. This is pretty much my bedroom. Uh, this is actually my childhood bedroom. Uh, I've come back to build. I've got a whiteboard here. I've got my setup here. I've got my bed here. And that's pretty much all we need. Obviously, we've got a little bro over here. We both locked in. Getting the work done. But, uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I just sit here on my chair every single day for countless amount of hours and uh, I get it done pretty much so let's let's get started it's around 8 30 a.m just woke up a little while ago and uh, we're gonna get started my first thing that I do every single day no matter what uh, which is my morning routine so let's get into it so I've got my daily routine right in here I look at it every day first thing is my morning routine and the first thing I do is an outside stretch but today is shit weather it's raining so I ain't going outside so yeah first thing I do is outside stretch or inside stretch uh, shadow box and water. So let's get into that. Oh, so pretty much when it comes to stretching, the reason I do it, and pretty much all I do is just follow a video. I mean, I've done it so many times now that I know what it is, so I just follow a routine. And the reason I do it is because I feel like it really, um, what am I, doing? I feel like it really wakes you up um, when you move the body properly and you stretch, like and you get, get, the, get the blood pouring, I guess. It, uh, for me, it just really helps just waking up, especially when it's early. I just get into the flow a lot easier. So I'm gonna do this and then we're gonna drink some water and then go for a shower. So after I have a shower, I do something called the mirror exercise. Pretty much what it is, you just stand in front of the mirror, I learned it from a book, and you just look yourself in the eyes and you just talk to yourself, pretty much whatever comes to your mind. I have a conversation about whatever's on my mind, uh, but especially, you know, what it is I wanna do, who I am, who I see myself as. I tell myself that I respect myself, I love myself, I'm the man. It may sound weird, probably does sound weird to be honest, um, and it did sound weird for me too, but after I started trying it and doing it as much as I can, hopefully every single day, um, it's changed everything. It puts me into a state where I'm actually able to do the work I need to do because I know that I'm capable of doing it, you know, rather than just kind of being, not depressed, but in a, in a kind of negative state. So, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm going to do that right now. So as you guys can see, I've had a bit of an impulsive thought and <laughs> I'm going to shave my head off. Um, I've done this a few times. And the main reason I'm going to do it is I really can't be bothered going, okay, I can't be bothered going for a haircut. So um, let me just finish this shit. I'll talk to you guys after. So yeah, 10 minutes later, here we are, fresh head. Like I said, I just pretty much couldn't be bothered. And I just felt like it, um, really don't want to go for a haircut. It takes, you have to book it in, go for two hours there and back. I just couldn't be bothered. I have too much work to do, too much money to make. So um, yeah, what we're going to do now is jump into um, meditation. So I do two types. First type is breath work. So if you search up on YouTube, just morning breath work, pretty much what it does for me, there's so many of them, just try them all. What it does for me is it really like puts me into a state where I feel happy. I feel excited. I feel ready to go. I think it actually chemically releases stuff in your brain where you feel that way. And the other type of meditation that I do is called a visualization meditation. So pretty much for me anyway, what happens is I start to visualize where, where I'll be and what I'll be doing when I reach my end goal. So let's say, for example, for the end of the year. I visualize where I'll be at the end of the year with that million dollars in my bank account, uh, what I'll be doing, giving back to my parents, taking them on holiday. I literally see exact scenarios that I'll be in. It's crazy. So that really puts me into uh, a state, again, where nothing in the day can make me procrastinate or make me want to be distracted. That's the main goal of all the stuff that I'm doing. So let me jump into that. I'll talk to you guys after. So I'm going to jump into reading my book now, and I'm reading The Obstacle is the Way right now. Um, really good book so far. Pretty much overall just teaches you that anything that you see as your obstacle or that's holding you back in your mind is not actually holding you back. It can actually be the way that you can go and use that to succeed. And it's a really good book, definitely recommend it. And I read in the mornings, uh, especially books like this, because it kind of puts me in that frame of mind. I take what I learn in a book like this, especially when it's around you know, productivity, uh, just winning in general. Uh, I use what I learn in the chapters that I read in the morning and take that into my day. And it's been a really nice habit to build up. So I read for maybe like 15, 20 minutes max, um, and I'll get into journaling and then start my work. So pretty much I'm gonna plan my day out now. Uh, I have all my tasks in my head. I'm gonna put into a checklist on the board and I'll talk to you guys after. Excuse the shit handwriting, but first is morning routine, got that done. Then it's complete module four of the program, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, then it's finished this YouTube video right now. 
then is to read all my prayers. I'm a Muslim, so I read five prayers a day and then go to the gym later on in the evening, reply to my mentees. I'll explain that later on too. Uh, check in with my team and also then have a call for my agency with a client. So yeah, that's the plan for today. Let's jump into it. As I'm sitting down, getting started with work now. And I know a lot of you guys may ask if you look to my YouTube channel and go to my Instagram, then you may see, you know, why am I back in Scotland, which is where I, where I grew up? You know, why am I back here rather than being in Bali or Dubai, which is where I was the last couple of years? Um, and the main reason is because I'll make a whole video about this, I think, but I just wanted to be in my own world. I just wanted to create my own world with no friends around me, really, nobody else around me, no distractions, nothing else. Because I'm in this phase right now where I have so much that I want to build. I have literally four companies that I want to build in the next six months. And obviously a million dollars to make, start from nothing. So yeah, uh, I didn't want any distractions around me. So I thought the best thing to do was to come home and of course, you get the added benefit of being able to spend a lot of time with my parents. You know, I get to do nice things with them, have dinner with them every day, uh, and just, you know, be at home, you know, just like have nothing else to think about except what I want to think about, which is obviously my work. So that is the main reason I'm back, and I'm going to be back here for as long as it takes. Uh, I just want no distractions right now. I just want to build what I'm building, and if you guys want to know what it is that I'm building, then go and watch the video. I'll leave it in the corner and just watch it after this video. It's where I, I go over my whole plan for what I'm going to be building uh, business-wise uh, until the point of me becoming a billionaire. But it will show you the kind of first kind of path. And I'm sure I'll make loads of other videos as well uh, showing the plans of how I'm going to build each business that I'm actually working on right now. But I'll explain, as I do each task, I'll explain to you kind of a small little um, summary of what each thing is. Let's get into it. So guys, it's time for work session one uh, and I'm going to complete module four. So essentially what that is, and definitely go ahead and watch the other videos on my channel, especially the ones that are going to come out very soon, uh, and the last one that I posted, I'm going to explain the context of my whole journey and what I'm building the, and the businesses that I'm building. I don't want to make this video too long, but essentially this right now is my program. This is the program that I'm building. After the last four years of being in the agency space and building agencies, I'm now going to build a program that's going to pretty much teach the new evolution of the agency business model that I've developed called a growth partner agency. And when I say module four, um, I'm still in the first phase and I'm in module four now. So I've completed these first three modules. They're now done, ready to for people to, for people to go through. I'm now going to finish this uh, module here. So it's a lot and lot of work. It's not, not easy at all. This is pretty much like my life's work. Everything that I know in my brain into, into a, a thing, like into a program. So it's like 10,000 words per, per module. And there's six phases and six modules per phase. So this is a lot of work, you know, it's, it's pretty much constant hours, like seven, eight, nine hours a day, just sitting down and putting my thoughts into a program and then recording stuff as well. So it's a lot. I'm gonna spend a few hours on this and then I'll go have breakfast. So guys, it's around 1.30 or one o'clock and I'm having my first meal now. So it's a bagel with a kebab, but just like a beef patty and then uh, egg on top. So. My first meal, I like to intermittent fast because I, I have those productive hours in the morning and then I eat something relatively right, light right now, but enough to keep me going. And then I get another three, four hours of work done and then I eat something a little bit again and then go to the gym. So I need this and I'll see you on my next task. So guys, back in the chair for the next few hours of work, I've finished breakfast now. So what I'm going to do first, just because I after I eat, I have like 20, 30 minutes of um, uh, just kind of like brain fog. So what I do is easier tasks. So right now, this these are my chats with all my mentees. I only have a very select few of them. And pretty much they're just guys that have come to me from seeing me going through my journey of building my agency, scaling my agencies, living my life. And they want to learn how to do the same. So they come, they came to me, asked me if I can mentor them. And I, I mentor them. So we have a one-on-one -on -one chat, have calls with them. I, I give them the tasks they need to do. They go through my program and I help them out. I check their things. So for example, with one of my mentees, he, this is his presentation for uh, pros, prospect clients that he's going to present to them to um, get them to book in a call with him, a sales call. So I'm looking over that right now. I'm going to edit that for him, make sure it's all good for him to go so he can go ahead and start sending clients. But uh, I'm going to do this for another hour and then I'm going to jump back into the program. So I'll see you there. So guys, I have my agency client Zoom call right now. I'm going to jump on this call. It's just a reporting call, maybe like an hour long uh, with myself and my team and the client just kind of reporting back on what's been happening talking about next steps, having a discussion like we do every month. And then, um, yeah, pretty much. Uh, and to explain as well, if you didn't know already, I run a TikTok growth partner agency. So essentially I partner with e-commerce brands. They pay us anywhere from five to 10K a month. And myself and my team, we run their TikTok operations. So we produce the content for them, run their ads, just grow the brand through TikTok and social media. So 
Yeah, um, and, and a side note as well, I, I've mostly delegated everything when it comes to my agency. I, I'm really just working on the program right now uh, because it's just the, the biggest thing that I have to do and it takes up so much of my, my, my mental space. Um, so my team handles everything with the agency. I just jump on calls, message my team, you know, just manage them. And uh, I'm just working on the program right now. So I'll do this a couple more hours until the gym. So guys, it's now 4.30. I'm, uh, so yeah, I think like six or something hours, in, hours into work. Spent like three hours doing the program, another hour doing the uh, checking in with my mentees and helping them, another hour on call, um, and yeah, I'm kind of feeling tired. I can't lie, it's uh, yeah, quite quite a lot in the mind. But I've got a few, a couple of more hours to go until the gym, and then uh, yeah, it's pretty much the way it goes. This guy's been sleeping behind me pretty much the whole day. That guy's not got up yet, but uh, yeah, I shall continue with work. Um, maybe get some, get a drink, get a quick snack, and then I'll um, see you just before the gym. It's, it's around seven o'clock now, and I'm going to walk to the gym. And uh, it's about a thirty-minute walk, twenty-five minutes. And uh, what I'm going to do in the meantime is I'm going I'm to listen to an audiobook. So I actually listen to two books at the same time. I read one, and then I listen to one. So the book that I'm listening to is called Loyalty to Your Soul. It's an incredible book so far, very very deep, um, but it's been really good so far. It So guys, I'm back from the gym. Also just had dinner with my parents. Um, my mum made me dinner, which is one of the big benefits of being at home. Getting home cooked food. And uh, yeah, pretty much it's now, I think, 10.20 in the PM. So yeah, now it's just nighttime routine, pretty much. So what I do in the evenings usually is I'll, pretty much every night, I'll aim to um, read slash listen to the audio book uh, at the same time uh, of the Quran, a translation of the Quran. Uh, something that I've been going through, not finished it yet, so it's the first time I've properly like gone through the translation of the Quran, you know, and I properly understood it. So it's been a pretty cool thing I like to do in the evenings, and then by ten thirty, maybe not sorry, eleven thirty, I'll probably be um, in bed asleep. Hopefully, that's that's the goal. So yeah, hope you guys really enjoyed the video. Hope you guys um got got a glimpse into what you know what it's really like, and I'm sure most of you are going through this through this as well. So if you are going through this, leave a comment. And if, if you're in this kind of phase, same phase as me, you want to build, you want to make a lot of money in the next six, seven months, you want to change your life completely, go ahead and let me know in the comments how, how it's going for you. And also go ahead and DM me on Instagram. It's at Qasim Akram, Q-A-S-I-M-A-C-K-R-I-M. -I -I I'll leave it here also in the description. Go ahead and DM me uh, and tell me you came from this video. Uh, and you can ask me any question you have. Uh, as soon as I see the message, I'll go ahead and shoot you a voice note back if you have any questions or just want to talk about anything at all. So um, yeah, much love guys. Make sure you subscribe. Um, I've got loads of cool videos coming and I'll see you on the next one.